the star of the week. え今週はこの人をスタジオに迎えました。Welcome, Suzanne. Thank you.、Um, I should say congratulations on the success of the record.、Uh, Thank you. Yeah, the Thank top you. three song, top two. Yeah, it was top three in America. How, how、yeah. do you feel now? I mean, the single. Tired. <laughs> you feel tired? <laughs> no, I've just I've been on the road since April of this year, so、mm-hmm. really I haven't had a chance to rest and let it all sink and in. And realize the、know. situation. Yeah, yeah,、uh-huh. it seems very abstract in a way. You know, it, it's hard for me to believe that it really went to number three. And、uh-huh. um, next year, I think when I'm thinking back, I'll say, yeah, it really went to number three. Yeah. But we've been so busy.、Um, I remember、traveling. reading somewhere in the、uh, newspaper that、uh, you hated to.、Uh, Compete with all the hit makers like Whitney Houston or you. Yeah,、Something、it、like、feels、that. strange to me. I certainly,、yeah. when when I wrote a lot of the songs for the record, I never imagined that they would be going into the top 40, and I hadn't written them to be top 40 songs. You didn't mean、uh, that. No, so it's a little, it's a little surprising. But、uh, but yeah, it's a it's a good feeling to feel that that、yeah. it's been so widely accepted. You were appearing in some of the clubs in New York, I understand. Yeah, when I was 16, I took my guitar and I started going out to some of the clubs in the village. And、uh, I must say, I did wasn't very successful at first because I was very quiet and very shy,、yeah. and had a tendency to be sort of intimidated by audiences.、Mm. Um, and I didn't like to talk to them much, you know. Or, or、uh, so it took me four years or so before I could actually get my first gig and feel comfortable enough to. To have my first professional gig, you know, I played、mm. at other places、mm. like coffee houses or、uh. folk festivals. Do you think you have improved over the years? I mean,、uh, yeah, I think it's still difficult. You know, I still feel a little shy on stage, and, and I make a great effort to communicate with the audience because it's hard for me. I'm, I don't have a very,、um, I don't run around a lot. I'm not very、uh, aggressive、mm. performer.、Mm. I prefer to let the, to bring the audience into me,、um, and so. So I'm always trying to figure out how to be a better performer and how to how to really communicate and how to be more energetic and how to get all the different moods across、um, with the performing as well as the words, because、um, the words aren't everything. You know, they're only one part of the performance. Left of center, Suzanne Vega. First accepted in England when、uh, where they had uh, the, uh, the acoustic movement, you know, they're going back to some acoustic sounds,、uh, some of the basic jazz or four beat jazz or folkish music.、Uh, well, we were accepted in England almost right away, which had surprised me because I'd never been there and I hadn't heard of any special, you know, I hadn't heard of any folk m- music revival、uh-huh. or anything there. I think what had happened was that England is. A country where, in order to be noticed or recognized, you have to be very different. You know, in order to get signed by a record company, you have to be different from somebody else.、Uh, whereas in America, you have to be the same. You know, if you're the same as Whitney Houston or the same as Madonna, the same as someone who's been tried already, you'll get recognized much more quickly. Whereas in England, everyone's always trying to be different. You know, you dye your hair or you wear strange、shave. clothes or yeah, you shave your head. You do anything you can to be different. So when I came along, I I was different than the other things that were out at that time. So I think they picked up on it more naturally.、Mm. You know, you're interested in、uh, making up your own video, or are you into? Yeah, I've gotten a little bit more involved. There's a possibility involved. there, right? I mean, yeah, we just did one for Solitude Standing, with、um, your conception. Yeah, with、uh, it was directed by Jonathan Demme, who had done the、uh, movie Stop Making Sense with the Talking Heads. Uh huh. Uh huh. And so we he、uh, directed the last video we did, and、um, in that video I dress up as as Solitude. Mm. You know, in a big、yeah. black dress,、mm. and I dance in it because I had been a dancer、uh, when I was in school.、Mm. So you get to see another side. Yeah, another side. One, two, one, two, three, four. Solitude standing, Suzanne Vega. Describe、uh, Suzanne Vega,、uh, off stage, off work, off studio.、Um, what kind of girl? <laughs>、um, 
very similar to the one you see on stage, I think. Uh -huh. um, there's not a big difference for me. I, I think off stage I'm probably a little more confident than the person on stage. Off stage, mm -hmm. I'm a little more outgoing. Um, you, you read a lot? Would, yeah, I read a lot too. Uh -huh. You know, all different kinds of things. How about I, some I of the things uh, girls are supposed to be doing? Cooking <laughs> or...? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I cook once in a while, not very often. Um, I read a lot of magazines, and I find that I, I play with makeup a lot. You know, I, I like to go shopping. I like to go shopping for makeup, and I like to go shopping for clothes. And it's, um, that, that's like a recently acquired taste. When I was a, an adolescent, I didn't care about clothes or makeup, and you know, would never wear makeup, and would wear my jeans every single day and spent all my time writing in my notebook. Oh. And uh, so now that I'm older, I spend all my time, you know, playing with makeup and, and putting on clothes, but, um, and a little less time writing. But uh, yeah. So I'd say that's probably my new hobby at this point, is, is testing out different cosmetics. <laughs> yeah.